Hi, this is Erin Harrison coming to you from the 21st IT Expo at the Miami Convention Center. I'm speaking today with Joyce Kim, Chief Marketing Officer of Global IP Solutions. Joyce, thanks for joining me. Thanks for having me. Um, so tell us what's happening with HD Voice and where does uh, GIPS operate in this field? Well, Global IP Solutions, or better known as GIPS in the marketplace, has been in the business for almost over 10 years now. Uh, we've been supplying the core technology, which is typically known in the industry as media processing uh, for voice over IP and now video conferencing as well. So lately, I mean, voice over IP as a industry has been around for quite a long time. Mm -hmm. um, I think the traction in, as of late has been mostly on the notion of HD voice, mainly because the concept of HD has become much more mainstream due to HD TVs and so forth. So, you know, as far as the uh, initiatives that are going on today, we're really at the forefront of driving a lot of them, having been in the industry for such a long time, as well as having supplying the core technology for a lot of the major players in the space right now. Okay, and um, from where you sit, how will bandwidth cope with the increasing demands of desktop video? I mean, that's a good question. Video does consume a lot more bandwidth, and networks will be strained uh, due to that. However, I think the technology is... Uh, advancing to the point where you've got a lot of efficiency going on as well as uh, networks are being built out uh, much more uh, intelligently so all around I think with the um, environment really supporting uh, the increase in demand it, it will um, work itself out. Uh, at what kind of challenges need to be overcome um, to provide high-quality web conferencing? I mean, there's no question that, uh, as you just talked about, bandwidth is certainly one of them. Uh, you have to be able to support a lot of different types of equipment, cameras, sound cards. Uh, there's so many variables. It also depends on where you're uh, you know, having this web conferencing from. So if you're outside versus in your office, it would uh, require very different um, handling of those types of scenarios. Um, certainly the processing power of computers and uh, servers are becoming much more powerful and cameras, HD cameras are fairly cheap to get today so I think all around the, a lot of the hurdles are being addressed. Uh, the investment implementation is probably the next hurdle. Okay. Um, and tell us a little bit about what's been going on at Global IP Solutions since the LA show. Sure. Uh, the two biggest things that we actually have coming up, um, we just announced uh, launch of our Android platform. We've, um, you know, mobile has become much more of a mainstream product as well, obviously with 3G and 4G and so forth. Uh, the smartphones are becoming much more like little mini computers. Mm. So we've definitely seen a lot of interest on the mobile side. Um, we're announcing the upcoming launch of our iPhone video. Uh, that's kind of the, the uh, newest development that we've got going. Um, so, and we'll continue to innovate on the uh, conferencing side as well with, um, you know, SVC technology for video conferencing and so forth. So, you'll see a lot coming out. Okay, cool. Um, and, and the current economic climate has presented quite a few challenges. How has, has GIPS had to respond to, to the challenges? I mean, as presented? most companies in this space, I think we've been... Um, less impacted because of the nature of what we do. So, you know, there is a strong ROI and cost savings proposition with video conferencing technologies as well as voice over IP. Um, so certainly it's been difficult as, um, you know, most of the world has seen. Sure. But by no means, I mean, we've actually grown in 2009 or over 2008. So I think there's definitely a lot of good things. Excellent. That's great to hear. And what do you hope to achieve while you're here at IT Expo this week? Well, I'm certainly we're meeting with a lot of customers. Uh, most of the exhibitors actually are our customers since we supply the core technology that uh, make all these things work. Mm -hmm. um, so hearing the, you know, roadmaps and plans and interests and strategies of our customers is probably the number one thing for us here. Excellent. I've been speaking with Joyce Kim, Chief Marketing Officer of Global IP Solutions. This is Aaron Harrison coming to you from the Miami Convention Center at IT Expo. Joyce, thanks for being here. Thank you. Have a great show. Thanks.